You called for me, my king. How fair thee on this splendid autumn day. I must say, my king, you are looking very pale. Do you not feel well? Is thou stressed, my king? Perhaps you would like a summit of some sorts. No? No, fine. How about some juggling? Acrobatics? Riddles! The king loves riddles, does he not? And don't I have a few spiffing ones, your majesty? <coughs> a vessel have I that is round as a pear, moist in the middle, surrounded with hair. And often it happens that water flows there. Can you guess what it is, my king? Take a guess. I know you can do it. A vessel have I that is round as a pear, moist in the middle, surrounded with hair, and often it happens that water flows there. Yes, your majesty, bravo! It is, in fact, the eye, the windows to the soul. Brilliant, your majesty, brilliant. And another, your majesty. Tell me. What is that that fills the sky and the whole earth and tears up new shoots and shakes all foundations, but cannot be seen by the eyes or touched by hands? Can you guess, your majesty? Oh, your majesty, it is but simple. Simple, can you not see? The wind, your majesty, the wind. It tears up new shoots, fills the sky cannot be seen or touched by hands. Is that not true, your majesty? Though that is not true now, is it? That I can see something plainly ails my king. My dear, dear king, what is it that fails you so? If thee cannot talk with your jester of the court, your best friend and confidant, then who really can you talk to? Nobody. No one ever listens to Majesty's wants and desires. Not really. It's all about what they want, how they see the kingdom. Is that not so? Of course, so. Tell me, Your Majesty. Tell me. As I sit on the royal lap, that I have done so many a time before, and run my fingers through the hair, the silken hair of the monarch. Tell me. Your Majesty, how Moon can help you right now. War is on the horizon, is it not, Majesty? <laughs> Why worry so, Your Majesty? Do you not send the warriors out to fight for you? While you sit here in your palace of kings, on your throne without worrying. Ah, is that not what ails Majesty the most? That you want to be like them? Do you not, Majesty? Do you not wish to be like us common folk? <sighs> Many nights I have heard my king speak of how he wishes not to be king. But why, when you have everything your heart can desire? Everything. Yet you wear a face of a smacked ass. My king, should you not be grateful for things you have? Should you not bask in the glory that you were chosen by God to sit on this very throne? Is that not right, Majesty? I, for one, see you as the glorious king you are. And, Majesty, I do like what I see. As I have told thee many times before, does Majesty not trust his jester, his faithful companion and entertainer? <laughs> Majesty, you know I cannot tone it down at all. This is who I am. I'm here for your entertainment. Am I not, Majesty? Am I not? So what does my king wish to discuss with me? He's lowly jester. Or am I not just your jester today? Majesty, for where does the royal hand go at this moment? Does it wish to touch the forbidden fruit, perhaps? Oh, oh, <gasps> So it does. A very improper majesty. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I see. Though majesty, uh, I cannot help but notice that you usually use the warmth of the flesh. Uh, uh, to, 
to distract yourself from what you're really feeling, Majesty. Ah, oh, that is not good for you. Not good at all. Oh, well, Majesty, one should let it all out. Not in that way. Oh, Majesty, you foul beast. Oh, oh. Naughty, naughty. Does Majesty never wish to marry? Oh, does he always wish to play with his jester boy like this? Forever. Well, oh, as long as you are on the throne, oh, they are going to want an heir. You do know this. Your responsibilities. Oh, you will never be able to escape them, Majesty. Oh, 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 my king. Please, control yourself. Control these urges. Oh, woe is me. What shall I do? Oh, he is becoming such a beast. Such a beast. What am I to do? Oh, my poor little frail body cannot fight off such a beast. Fight off such a... My king, behave yourself. Oh, oh, oh. oh. One moment. One moment, Majesty, please. Hold this now. I do like the way you look at me like that, my king. So fierce. Well, I have dared to take your pleasure away. Oh no, what shall I do? Will you behead me? I doubt it very much. What is the answer to the riddle, Majesty? And then I may let you finish. Yes, I am giving you orders now, and I realize my cane likes to change it up a bit. Tell me, Majesty, I am soft as wool, soft as a bog. When I swell up, I'm like a frog. I grow in water, where I plunge. What is it, Majesty? Tell me. Tell me, won't you? A sponge. Yes, Majesty, yes. Bravo. Majesty, yeah. Oh, just, 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 just. <sighs> Why must you try and keep it going? <sighs> Majesty's so greedy. Such a greedy, greedy king. Mm. Mm. So greedy, in fact, he finishes in less than. Ooh. Well. Not much time at all. Ah, ah, Majesty. You know how I like to tease. Is that not why I'm here, Majesty? Hmm? To entertain my king so, and to infuriate his confidants, and everybody who whispers in your ears, telling you this, telling you that, when I know who my king really is. <laughs> and what is that? You ask. He is the sun to my moon. Yes, Majesty. You are. You are you. And do not ever believe that you need to stop being you. Ever. You are a great king. Let them know it, Majesty, always. Do you hear? You know your jester speaks wisely, always, and always speaks the truth to you, Majesty. They think me mad. But Majesty, I am only mad for you, of course. I have grown very fond of thee, Majesty, and all of our secluded meetings. <sighs> the Majesty, you do have a kingdom to foresee. I can never get in the way, but... But I am always there for you. And you know, Moon is the only one who will tell you the truth. And I will never lie to you, my King. I swear it. Now, how about some more riddles? Ha ha ha.